XRP suddenly became the top gainer in the top 100 today. We talked a little bit about it earlier on our live stream that we had right here on the channel. If you guys are not yet subscribed, make sure you do that because we're going live all the time. We're putting out videos. We're putting out short form content. We've got you covered here with all different kinds of crypto content. And it's wild times right now in the market, so you don't want to miss out. But we've... Uh, we've had a sudden surge here and, and I want to talk about it a little bit, talk about some levels that we're looking for uh, from the price standpoint. Also talk about, you know, when we could see maybe some major uh, continuation of this rally and some of the things that uh, I'm thinking, you know, is kind of creating this surge that we've seen today. So uh, let's dive into this article. We'll come back to these charts because I do want to show you guys some important things we're looking at there, but I want to dive into this article here. Uh, which basically gets at XRP and its big move today. If we look at the overall market, uh, Litecoin actually right now leading the way just barely over XRP. Uh, this fluctuates, as you guys know, by the minute, by the hour. XRP, though, earlier today was the top gainer in the top 100, sitting just shy of a $40 billion market cap. Uh, XRP sitting at a crucial level of 73 cents. Chainlink on the run today, too, uh, up over 19% as well. Uh, it's a fraction of what XRP is, but uh, let's get you know let, let's get into this first, and then we'll come back to to price action and and you know button everything up over there, and I'll give you guys my thoughts. But if we look at some of the data uh, from the derivatives data, and that's what this article gets at, uh, it does reveal a really nice bullish sentiment among traders right now of XRP. The trading volume has surged here this afternoon, and uh, of course in the last twenty four hours. 348%, reaching a big number of 5.62 billion. We can uh, click XRP and see that we're actually above that now since that article was written. 6.2 billion of volume right now uh, coming in. That's up 334.5% in the last 24 hours. 6.2 billion in volume uh, flowing in and out of XRP. A lot of it inflowing right now, as you guys can see there, excuse me, on the daily chart. So if we go back here, uh, it says here, open interest, which is a big indicator that we look at, is the total number of outstanding derivative contracts, such as uh, things like futures, options uh, that have not been settled. Those two also saw a big increase here this afternoon, 30% uh, totaling a little over a billion dollars, despite about a 47% decline in options, volume, options, open interest climbed by 15%. What does this show us? Well, it shows us that XRP traders right now are seeing some long-term value in holding XRP options. And when we go back to the price standpoint, we'll come back to this article, but they're holding this interest in long-term options right now, because if you look at yesterday and the day before, you know we've had a nice little burst here. We were at 55 cents not too long ago, back in mid-February. This is the weekly chart, by the way. So every candle you see here is a weekly candle. But this week of Monday, the 26th, we had uh, a very similar thing happen that we're seeing here today. We saw a very similar thing happen. We went from 54 cents at the beginning of the week, and we closed uh, right around 63 cents. So it was a nice little push. You can see on this candle right here. Last week, very choppy, pretty much consolidated. A lot of other things were doing well. XRP was pretty stagnant. And now this week opens up. And keep in mind, this is just Monday. Okay, it's just one day. This is the weekly candle here. But uh, things are opening up in a hurry here. And uh, this is a one-day candle. You can see this a little bit more if we go into the one-day chart, just how big of a deal this is. We have not seen a green candle like this in a really long time, guys. We've got to go back to, obviously, the big run in July that we had the big run-up where we almost got to a dollar. With the XRP price, that was based on, you know, the sales of XRP from the retail side not being deemed a security. That was a huge catalyst. We've got to go way back there, uh, in terms of the last time we saw a green candle like this. There you go. That gives you a perspective. That's the daily here. Uh, we've been on that uptrend for a little while, but nothing like this. And all of a sudden, you know, if we go back into our weekly, you can see these two lines I've drawn in here. And there's a reason why I did it where I where I put these lines. This bottom line is right around 50 cents. The reason why I have it drawn here is because there's a lot of interest that we've seen over the years, especially the last few here, where uh, XRP whales or those who hold a lot of XRP 
they tend to buy when we get down to these levels, especially if XRP dips a little bit below 50 cents or wicks down. They seem to be stacking up on XRP at these prices. So I've pretty much created this little bit of a range right now. And then to the upside, we've seen here a couple of different times in the last, uh, you know, since July of 2023, a couple of different times we've come up to about this 73 cent range and have been rejected. So I'm going to get really excited if we can get above, and you can see where we're at right now on my blue line. We're right above it, or excuse me, right below it. If we can get above this and sustain some good volume and get a couple days above this blue line that I've generated here, that's where I'm going to get really excited about where we could potentially go here, even in the short term with XRP. But there's no doubt that there's interest. There's another thing that's happening too. And this is another article. And the Ripple CEO, Brad Garlinghouse, earlier today, uh, went to Twitter and emphasized the soaring volumes of Bitcoin ETFs and just how much money is coming into Bitcoin right now from the ETFs as a really good catalyst for other top altcoins. And it says this comes alongside the anticipation of Bitcoin's halving, which obviously is a huge event. BTC ETF volume has been soaring, uh, due, uh, we're due for having, and the broader crypto market is following Bitcoin's lead. This is coming from Garlinghouse himself, as has historically been the case, meaning all coins, some of the top ones following Bitcoin, uh, Bitcoin's footsteps. As someone who has experienced multiple cycles of, quote, crypto is back, it's imperative this bullishness go hand in hand with, and then it kind of cuts out. You know what? We'll go over to Twitter and actually see what the whole tweet said. Go find CEO at Ripple. Here it is. It says here, uh, as someone who's experienced multiple cycles of crypto is back, it's imperative this bullishness go hand in hand with real world utility. That's the real and inevitable march of progress. Of course, he's alluding to XRP having real world utility, and we know they do. This kind of highlights the video I put out late last night, pretty much the wee hours of the morning, talking about eventually we're going to have a crypto bull run that is focused in on utility-based cryptos. Right now, we're seeing a lot of altcoins without any utility. Community tokens, meme tokens, having their day. And that's how this market moves. It moves in cycles. It moves in various stages. But eventually, a lot of people believe that you know at some point in this bull run, we're going to see uh, the cryptos like XRP have their day. And maybe we're starting to see that, especially from the institutional side of things, as Bitcoin's price continues to go higher and higher and higher, some of that capital is going to flow a little bit downward into your top altcoins like Ethereum, like XRP, like Solana, like some of the other top plays up there at the top. If we go back to the article here, I want to close out this video here in just a couple minutes. Appreciate you guys for staying with me. Uh, if you haven't hit that like button, definitely do so. It says here, the dramatic increase in XRP's price was not without turbulence since data over various timeframes revealed significant liquidations. Within a single hour, 1.02 million worth of positions were liquidated, highlighting the market's volatility and risks involved in trading XRP futures. That means the shorts were wrecked. Those people betting that XRP would go down, we're forced then to buy XRP, which leads to what? Big price pumps, like we saw. Okay, uh, so that looks pretty solid right there, uh, just overall. But again, I'm going to get really excited once we burst through 73 cents, guys. Really excited. If and when we do, and we get some type of indicator, you know where it'll come from. It'll come from our uh, XT Algo trading indicator, where you can easily set up your own custom alerts, for anything crypto, stocks related, et cetera. Uh, you can watch how this trading indicator works on my website here. About a six, seven, uh, actually eight minute video here on how it works. If you do decide to get in, uh, there is a big discount code in the description of the video. Instead of this price, uh, the prices you see here, tack, uh, tack off 21% of all these prices. It's a 30 day money back guarantee. So you could try it risk free today, at least give it a month. If you don't like it, full refund, no questions asked, but very confident you're going to love it. we got hundreds of people using it, and uh, it's definitely been working here as crypto has been on a surge uh, here lately. So appreciate you guys for checking out the video. Let me know what you think about XRP, but those are some of my thoughts. Those are some of the things we're looking for, some of the news that's out there. Appreciate you guys, and we'll continue to watch XRP's price as it is pumping today. 
but that crucial XRP ripple price level is 73 cents for me. If we can get over it and close above it and show some strength above it, that's where I can get really excited and get behind uh, some potential uptrends here with XRP in the short term. All right, we'll see you in the next video. Take care.